Good day to my diverse viewers. My name is Sherlock Bailon and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. So today we have a very important topic to tackle. So are you ready? Because I am ready. Let's start! Why is it important to understand cultural diversity in language? How is it beneficial to everyone? So here's five tips on how to understand and promote cultural diversity in language in a classroom. Tip number one, getting to know everyone. Try to get to know everyone's nationality, culture, and custom inside a classroom. So for teachers and students, since our society becomes more diverse as years pass, it is important to know everyone whom you would be meeting on the following days. Tip number two, use the common language. So everyone may appear to have differences with each other as referred to as language is often um, viewed as a complex system that reflects what meaning are attached so to behaviors or cultures and how they are expressed. With this, let us use the common language as it provides means of communication among different individuals in, as, in a group or in a classroom. So for example, so as, as we are in the Philippines, let us use Filipino as for it is our national language. Tip number three, learn to communicate with respect and acceptance. Um, let's say you just met with each other. So try to be more careful on communicating with everyone. Um, some things may appear unusual to you, but put in mind um, to observe respect and accept everyone's diverse values and cultures as you communicate. Because not everyone has the, um, the same sense of thinking. Others may be offended easily and others may not even care. So try to communicate with utmost respect and acceptance. Tip number four, practice cultural sensitivity um, in accordance to language. So as you may already have a common language, you should um, be aware that it is not to put shame or insignificance to each and everyone's um, own language or mother tongue. So it is important to keep an open dialogue as teachers and students communicate with each other. The same as how everyone should make sure of being sensitive to everyone's culture, beliefs, and language concerns. So to complete the list, here's our tip number five. Integrating cultural diversity of language in the lesson plan. Understanding cultural diversity of language should be presented in any means, and that includes in lesson plans. The classroom environment is important um, for fostering cultural awareness to every student, as well as the importance of someone's language as a social identity. So incorporating of language diversity should be included as part of the thematic approach of a certain subject to help every student um, be comfortable and give more attention to the topic you are teaching as a teacher. So that sums up our five tips on how to promote and understand cultural diversity of language in the classroom. Just put in mind that language serves as a vehicle um, for expressing our thoughts. This is related to as language gives us a social knowledge or background of someone's cultural aspect. Understanding cultural diversity of language is important as we interact with each other as it can help build um, bridges to trust, respect, and understand across culture. So diversity constructs our society to be a fascinating place to live as it gives everyone curiosity of acquiring new knowledge from um, different cultures, from every culture. Music